The royal family of Denmark attended a religious service today as part of the proclamation of Frederick X. On this occasion Mary Donaldson once again looked spectacular in her image, the events surrounding the proclamation of Frederick X as King of Denmark are not yet over. Last Sunday there was a ceremony at which Queen Margaret signed her abdication and her firstborn son came to the throne. The next day, the Danish royal family went to Parliament to attend the succession ceremony. And this Sunday, they concluded the events of this new phase by attending a service Frederick and Mary of Denmark and their children visited the Cathedral of Aarhus, Denmark's second most populous city. An event at which the new queen consort once again showed style. If on the day of the proclamation she chose a beautiful white dress, and on Monday she showed her elegance in a dark blue look, a color typical of the royal family, this Sunday she dazzled again with the style with which she confronted the snow that fell during the event. The look that Mary Donaldson wore to face the cold is the most flawless combination for winter guests. She wore a lilac dress which she paired with an elegant black cape outside. These outerwear pieces set the trend for winter 2024 when it comes to elegantly completing a look. As for the dress, Mary Donaldson turned to one of her favorite silhouettes. Tightened at the waist and then transitioning into a puffy skirt, it looked very stylized and flattering. Moreover, it's a garment we've seen him wearing before, as it's the same one she wore at Charles III's coronation in England. As for the shoes, she opted for classic ones, with which the result is even more stylized. Mary Donaldson also wore a very elegant headdress. As for the hairstyle, for this event the Queen of Denmark had a half-updo and chose to style her hair in waves Mary Donaldson's strength since she was the Queen of Denmark. In doing so, Queen Mary once again showed the image of strength that she has displayed since Queen Margaret announced her abdication on December 31st. Gone is the serious and humble attitude she displayed because of the pictures of her husband Frederick walking with Genevieve Casanova around Madrid. Now the wife of the King of the Danes has more authority than ever. And that's not the only thing that has been handed down these days. Mary has also decided to give importance to her more familiar side. Mary Donaldson used the fact that her children accompanied her to events on these special occasions to leave behind images of unity and complicity. This Sunday, the situation was repeated. Kings Frederick and Mary attended the religious service accompanied by their children, Christians heir Isabella and twins Josephine and Vincent. With their attitude, the six made it clear that they were now the core of the Danish royal family, now that the events surrounding Frederick's proclamation as King of Denmark had come to an end, a new phase was beginning in the Danish royal family. Mary Donaldson will now have a busier schedule. Some speeches in which he undoubtedly continues to demonstrate the image of strength with which he leaves all controversies behind. On the opposite side is Genevieve Casanova. Just a few hours before today's religious service in Denmark, her ex made an abrupt decision. A few months later, after taking a few steps on Instagram, he made the most radical gesture by deleting his account completely.